Hello everyone, we're in the Cayman Islands. My name is Xi'an Gregory, and this is one of our students in Canada, uh, Sensei Gary Wong. We're going to be demonstrating the three technologies today. They're all based on efficiency. They're especially applicable in sport karate, but also applicable in street karate as well for self-defense. Minimum movement, maximum focus. The first technology is going to be in a tunnel. We call it the hornet's nest. Getting in and out as quickly as you can. The second one is being in the tunnel initially, but moving to the left side of Bob, and this is Bob, our target. The third one, staying within the tunnel with the Maya Gary and shifting to the right side of the target. Thank you very much. Sensei Gary will now demonstrate the distance in for the gun. The idea is to remain in that tunnel. That's number two. That's number three. Number one again, please. Front kick, jab, reverse. My Gary, Izami Zuki, Yakazuki. Second one, My Gary on the same spot. Shut side sifting, jab, punch, reverse punch. And third one, My Gary in exactly the same spot off the back leg, jab, punch, reverse punch. What you have to understand is the first technology is done down the tunnel. The next two are done in the tunnel and then shifting to the outside, first to the right side as we talked about. And then the second one off the power leg, the back leg, to the left side of the dummy. When we look at the dummy, the person standing in front of it should not be, we should not see their head wavering from side to side. So what we're looking for is efficiency of movement. As well as all targets are centered and when we go to the side of the dummy on both sides, they're exactly temple to floating rim. Thank you very much.